Hey guys, welcome to today's video. I have one of my most favorite people ever here on my channel oh my God. again. Yes. This is Kaylee Melissa. Hi. And if you have not subscribed to her, make sure you go and do that ASAP. Um, of course, first watch the video because you're, what do you have planned? You have like a hair transformation. She doesn't obviously. even know. She doesn't even have, you were just like, let's collab, show yeah. up and yeah. you can do whatever. And now I'm here. You're my hair go-to channel on YouTube. Yay. If you guys don't know, she did my hair on my wedding day. Oh my God. On my wedding day that was like the best time ever we had so much fun i loved it in maui i'm so glad i got yeah. to be there not only have i known tachi for years i've watched your videos for years oh. and i've got to see like your styles kind of evolved a little bit your like rocker edge comes out a little bit more and like just like a little bit tiny bit i tiny feel like bit. you were very there was a while where you were very like I, yeah, I've gone through like different seasons, especially with my hair. Like I had like some prom style hair going on for a while that was very like hairspray. Hey guys, welcome to today's video. I am gonna be doing a brow showdown. We're doing something different. We are gonna be going through my bad bin drawer. I have a trash bag ready. I, as a viewer, I've seen you do this hairstyle a whole, whole lot. Yep. And um, you always play around with your makeup. You play around with your fashion. I just wanna play around with your hair oh. a little bit. No, it's true okay. though, you guys. Do you know what I do? This or straight. Or I'm lazy and I put in a ponytail that does not even look cute. Or I do the really not cute one where I look like the buns, like the same size as my head. So for, yeah, for hairstyle number one, I wanted to, cause there was a long time on your channel where you were like in a bun with a makeup brush in your hair. Oh God. Like, yes, there was. I just wanted to get my hands in there and make it like a glam life guru moment instead of just like a accidental moment. Yeah, okay, so this is what I do because okay. I hate falling out of focus and I'm lazy and I don't want to stop the camera. So I'm like, oh, I need this out of my way. When will I learn, Tati, to keep a rubber band nearby? So what I do oh is I gosh. just- that's so That was impressive, that little maneuver you just did. See? Oh my it's gosh. not that bad. So one thing that you could do just to sub out the makeup brush for something a little bit more glam life guru okay. is actually this little Prezi that I brought oh. for you. Oh my gosh, she comes with gifts? I, Are you kidding? I do come with gifts. Ooh. This is called, this is a hairpin. It's called Ooh. the French oh hairpin. The ideal or the easy way is that you just kind of like sew it in oh. to your hair and then it holds it in place. But okay. then when it sticks out, it like, it looks cute and purposeful. Not, not like a makeup brush. What I do on my channel is I try to give you guys like really easy ways to do something different with your hair. And that's all I'm trying to do with this hairstyle. It's just yes. something like a little bit different. I feel like it's always harder to put someone else's hair in a high ponytail than it is to put your it own all, hair. Oh yeah, it is. I think that's why hairstylists came up with the trick of like you put half of it up and then you put the other half up. I learned that from you and I do that. Oh yeah, my like five minute ponytail video. Mm -hmm. I do that all the time. Okay, so growing up, my mom would perm her hair and her oh, hair literally would be too. like out to here. And one time she picked me up from school and I was still in elementary school, so I was super little. She literally had permed her hair and it something happened where she dyed it or something and it went green too, like too much ash blonde. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And that can happen. she picked me up and I started crying because I didn't recognize my mom. Oh no. And she was like, you you don't like it. Now I feel bad thinking of this story, but as a kid I was like, no, I don't like it. Why, you don't look like my mom. And she's like, what? She's like, what do I look like? And I'm like, you look like a tree. <laughs> <laughs> Just forget the bun, let that fall. That was... <laughs> Can you imagine? Ooh, this is cute, Kaylee. Thank you. I do not look like a tree right now. I all right, like let me know if I hurt you at all, but I feel like... This is where I prank you and go, ah! Yeah, that's exactly ah! when that should have been. Oh, that's right. way too big for you. <laughs> Woo! Hello. Here, let's put the smaller one in. Oh my gosh. In. Yeah, I'm gonna give you this smaller one because I just ordered the big, I ordered them online and I was like, I don't know what size is the best. Ooh. And you can also do it, this is a little pebbles and bam bam. You can also do it to yes. this to an angle. Yabba dabba do. I like it. <laughs> Yabba dabba I do. Like it. Do you know what? That feels amazingly secure. Yeah, it is because it's like the biggest hairpin you ever need. And you know what else yeah. is really great? What? I wanted to talk about these. These are like, oh, I, I love those. You know these? I love those. You can't buy them anywhere though. You oh, I know. I've only found them at Friends. Oh, you can buy them online. Right? Oh, really? Yeah. Really? This is, they're called Frenchies. They're flocked hairpins. We're gonna so link those below. They have like little fuzzy yes. tips on them. And I, I love them. Love if you're a dancer, you have to buy them. So much. This is not a sponsored moment at all. I actually couldn't even find this Cause online. Because Kaylee brought them, yeah. 
I have like three of them left because we all know the story. Bobby pins just like wander off. They have a life of their own. And I had a pack of these and they were like the best things because for my hair, I have a lot of it. And so I could like it. get away with pinning two. Oh yeah, I use like, one. Boom, boom, and that's it. I don't know why, it just works so well. No, they because they have all the grip. If you have thick hair, like you have to buy them. It's, it's not it's, even a question. Yeah. All right, yeah, I went it. back to the big one. I liked it better. Well, Ooh, totally I'm ready to film. Here's another fun little one that you can, hypothetically you can do your bun with this, but I haven't been able to. This oh. thing looks like, it, it looks, looks like, like a safety pin for your hair, right? I kind of really love that, actually. I, yeah, it, it's very Glam Life Guru. It is. They have where, it in rose gold and black, and normally I would put this in the back here. I call these awkward buns, and I love them, but just in case anybody at home doesn't, you can do your ballerina buns. I like a good messy, messy bun. Do you know what I do? Because um, I really like the messier look sometimes, especially if I'm on like day three with my hair. I'll put my hair in a bun and I'll literally go like this and I'll like mess it up. And, yeah. I'll, get, and I'll get all of those like flyaway pieces and I'll kind of like make them work with it. Yes, I like this Ooh, better. Yeah, I like this. I feel like I'm ready to like sit at a business meeting and give them all of my thoughts and then like walk out of the room and be like, mm. I know that you're loving scrunchies and so I feel sure like am. maybe not with this particular outfit, but I feel like... A scrunchie with a top come knot on. can be no, so this, cute. This, this with this outfit, come on. It can work. Oh my gosh. It can work. Valley girl. Right? Here we go. Oh my gosh, would you guys take me seriously? Dancing queen. I, I just, love These are just like kind of fun, Aren't right? they fun just they're to wear? Really cute. I actually brought you a few that you can play around with. These are even good for like sleeping in because they're so gentle Ooh. on your hair. Oh, these are, are from, these from? These are from Kitsch. How it's do you my know all, com. all like the cool hair places? Because I love them. <laughs> Stop it. Like I go to Target and I find nothing and I'm like, well, never mind. See, you know? I think that there's a market out there for it. I think that I like think so hair, accessory, hair accessory companies underestimate themselves a little bit. They, they think that people do. are interested. They make it so cheese ball though. It's like rhinestones and like ugly patterns. Right. Like that's But no, cute. like Kitsch has cute stuff. I wanted to try one last thing with that like scrunchy thing to see if it would be cute, but I don't know how it's... Because you have these cute little like pieces. There's this like inspo image that I love from Justine Marjam where there's like these short pieces, but yours are a little bit long. Yeah, let's try. All right, and then I'm just curling this up kind of near your eyebrow and I'm sliding the iron out and letting it run over the ends. It seems like it's hard, but all you really have to do, you duck this little guy around here. So you just turn it to be straight Ooh. and then you bring it back out and you just pull it over the ends like a straightener. I have a lot of videos on curling my hair because I really am very passionate about it. This is so cute. Why do I feel like I need like a pair of glasses or something I could to, to be like, mm. why is that my noise lately? Do you find that you mm. do like one thing that I'm like, mm. I look like Maria and I go, <laughs> no, I can't do that still. I met James Charles at her wedding and he was giving me so much shade when I was trying to tongue pop. I was like, what's that noise that like drag queens make where they like, and he was like, no, because no. literally his sounds like he busted out a megaphone. You could hear it like miles he away. He has a special like skill. Echoes, he could go on America's you know? Got Talent with yes. just the mouth pop. He could, he could, he could. Oh, God. Wow, that's loud. I know, it's kind of fun. Okay, let me put a little bun in real quick just okay. to like see how the bun looks with it. Okay. Now that we're trying out all sorts of new fun things for you. This is my signature awkward bun. We're just gonna go in pieces. Do -do -do. This is another trick that works if you have a lot of hair is to like go in sections. So I have like part of her bun wrapped and then I can wrap the rest without having to worry about dropping the first part. I actually super love this hairdo. Like yes. a lot. Can you Yay. come back tomorrow? <laughs> and every day after. So if you want to be subtle, you could try something that's closer to your hair color. Oh. So these are the ones from Kitsch just for funsies. I like love. It. This is my favorite so far. I love it. So what's your favorite hair video that you've done? Ooh. You've done a lot. I've done so many. I did this Lizzie McGuire hairstyles video. I wore wigs, I did Lizzie's hair, I did Miranda's hair. Oh my gosh. And if you've never like really dressed up as like a childhood icon, you have no idea how amazing it feels when you like, I don't when know, you it's do like- the whole look? Yes, yeah. I will link that video below. <laughs> um, I did Game of Thrones for Halloween last year. Ooh. And um, I had people that were helping me film it and edit it. So it looks way better Ooh. than my videos like normally do. And um, I did the same thing for Wonder Woman. And I just okay. loved all of those because I, I like the women. Ooh, I just got a facelift. 
right? Yeah. Wow. Wiggity, wiggity. Oh my God, yes. Where are the ear tabs? See, this is how I wake up in the morning, pretty much. <laughs> James is gonna come home and I should say that you dyed my hair and cut oh my it. Oh gosh, and cut it. Let's brush this out Ooh. and style it so you don't look so cray. Okay, cool. Cause right now, yeah, you look like a crazy ant that like escaped from right. somewhere. Honey, I'm here to pick you up from school. You need to earn your tuition money for college. <laughs> no offense to crazy ants out there. Do you ever feel like you have to say like, no what? offense to... No, I, I'm at the point where I'm, I'm cool with offending people. If you're offended, you can just leave. They're like, you look at your monitor. It means you're full of yourself. Tati's evil. I mean, like, really? I've come to a place where because I can't win, I'm just gonna be me. Honestly, like, cause you had that transformation mentally a couple years ago and it mm -hmm. was so, it's been inspirational for me and like my oh, process of growing up and learning to accept myself. Like first, I think the first thing you have to learn as a YouTuber is to accept yourself before you can let, as a person, yeah. you have to accept yourself before you can expect other people to accept you. Mm -hmm. And I had to go through that process of like learning to love and accept myself mm -hmm. while being on camera. I feel like the comments that hurt the most are the insecurities that we fear are real. I agree 1000%. You know, so yeah. if somebody recognizes that in you and you don't like that about yourself, that hurts. That's, yeah. Like we all have these little things, even if we're confident, we all have these little things that maybe we fear other people see. I went through a phase way, way, way back when where because people would pick on my clavicle bones so much that I would only wear scarves. You know, I've been heavier, I've been lighter, whatever. This stays the same. Like this is all, these bones, they yeah. are here. When I started my YouTube channel, my arms were like, I, I carry my weight in my arms and I was about 40 pounds heavier. And <sighs> so people commented, oh my God, how big are her arms? I bet they're like this many centimeters around and stuff like that. Rude. Yeah, and so, <gasps> but the way that I cropped my videos from then on was to crop them from here up. I never Why do we here. do that? It should not matter. That should not matter. Yeah. And you're like, like honestly, inside and out, one of the most gorgeous, gorgeous people like ever, this right here. Like beautiful soul and also you're just, you're just beautiful. Thank so you. my husband's like outside the window. Oh my God. He's like waiting so <laughs> sweetly. Oh my God. She cut and dyed my hair. What do you think? Wow, looks beautiful. Now I know you're a liar. Oh, I know you're a liar. <laughs> <laughs> Stop. <laughs> Don't I look fabulous, honey? You look so chic. You look like you need to like, you need a bottle of wine or at least a, a giant glass of wine in your hand right now. Are you ready to snatch this wig? Snatch this wig. All right, so this last look we're gonna do is one that I just thought would be like crazy fun. Like, I don't know when you would ever do this, but when? I wanna go for like wet hair. Like, oh, okay, like, let's do are it. Are you okay if I reference the Kardashians? Like yeah, Kim no, K, wet yes, hair. Yes. I feel like she's the one that I've seen really pull it off. And pull it off well. Girl. Like you look at that and you're like, I would like that style, please, thank you. So I'm just gonna go through and put a little bit more of a wave in. Just okay. kind of try to even out the the braid waves and the okay. waves you already had in. Oh yeah, girl, you glamorous Ooh. Tati. Oh my gosh, these curls. She's the queen of curls. Look at this. Stop it. This is so good. I love curling hair so much. <gasps> What is this even? I, I love you so much that you went and grabbed a towel. So it's that we a new do this. shirt. It's velvet. You, you know, know what? I can't have totally, it. Totally. That's honestly. That's totally, totally legitimate. All right. So basically, the first thing that you do, and one of the reasons I went in curled, is that you do the oil first. Oh, we're protecting the face too. <laughs> Um, I need one of those plastic things. You know, like oh, I love those. I need to buy one for my clients. I'm doing a foundation wear test. Oh, well then that's fair. I was about to say, Tati, like normally I wouldn't call you high maintenance like that much, but. Oh, I'd be doing this regardless. I am high maintenance. Put that on a t-shirt. I'll wear it. <laughs> okay, sit back up. Let me see. Oh. She's starting to feel it. Mm-hmm. 
I feel like it's that oh, oh, oh. That's what we know. I kind of like that actually. Yeah, that's a, that's how you do it. You just put in a bunch of oil because it gives your hair moisture. Mm -hmm. Just um, you know, it's either oil or water. I just so. didn't realize that you would curl it first. That's so cool. Yeah, because you you style it basically into the shape that you want, a little bit tighter because the oil loosens it. But yeah, you can style it like that first. Ooh. If your hair was naturally wavy, you know, you might be able to do a little bit of scrunching and oil. This is what I look like when I step out of the shower. Obviously, me Obviously. too. <laughs> Grab a towel. Huh, I'm done with my morning shower. <laughs> Again, advertising. Right? Yeah, this is looks like a hair commercial. Buy this shampoo. And you can have this life as well. I feel like shampoos get marketed as like, will make your hair shiny, will make it grow faster, will wash your car, will pay off your student loans. Mm -hmm. Like, it's soap for your it's, hair. It's soap. Like, let's get a few things straight. It's soap. <laughs> All right, next I'm going in with the, we're going from Kerastase to Herbal Essences. I am just an air freshener right now. Fruit Loops stick, and Vanilla Stick must. me in a room, I'll make it smell good. I actually super love it, no joke. I feel like particularly with a, like a cocktail dress or like something, mm -hmm. like I feel when you wear this hairstyle, you have to juxtapose it against something else. How to get Kim Kardashian hair. <laughs> Ding. I'm gonna use one last product. This is the Tough Guy Wax from Fat Boy. Oh my gosh, use hair product the same way that I use brow product. Jeez. Yes, ma'am. Yes. I'm like the I queen really of though. using like five things for whatever situation and you just keep going in like, but wait, there's more. Well, this is it. I've used three products. Like that's not even a lot for brows. Maybe it is. It kind of is, right? That's like People how much I use. are like, why do you use a powder? a gel and a pencil and I'm like, cause it works. You guys, I love my hair right now, but I wanna hear from you. What was your favorite? Let me know in the comments below. And also, make sure that you go and subscribe to Kaylee. She is the very, very best for hair. I freaking love really? you. Like honestly, oh God, thank you. we just spent hours creating all these hair looks and just hanging out. And she's just one of my very, very favorites. So go oh. make sure that you subscribe. Thank and you. Um, yeah, thanks for, for everything. You're I so love welcome. my hair right now. I'm gonna be so conditioned. Honestly, I'm so shook at how cute the wet look is on you. I'm gonna do this again. I actually really, really love it. Oh my so, God, you should. yes. All right, you guys, thanks for hanging out with us, and I will see you in my next video. Mwah.